inside of the very famous Grand Canyon. This is absolutely an unbelievable hike. You can actually hike down inside of it. And as you go down, you can see that the walls that you're hiking down through are actually all sedimentary rock, which means that this canyon that goes down a mile was actually piled up little by little by little by little by little to go a mile high. And then it actually carved right back down. So the Colorado River is somewhere down there, about a mile down. Uh, and it actually has been carving away at this canyon for millions of years. It just keeps on carving down and down and down and down. So this is a really amazing spot to see the effects of how high you can build with sedimentary rocks, how big you can actually pile them up on top, um, on top of each other. Because if we look at that wall, you can actually see all the layers. Those layers are representing hundreds of millions of years of Earth's history. So the top of that wall right there those are actually some of the youngest rocks. And as we look down into the wall, we can actually see older rocks below them because in geology, we have the principle of superposition. So we always have the youngest is on top and the oldest is down at the bottom. So when we look at the bottom, we actually can actually see down literally millions of years of history just by looking at this canyon wall. The way we got to that is through weathering ero and erosion. So there's a river that flows through the middle of this, it's the Colorado River, and it's been eroding this canyon for millions of years. And it actually has exposed some very, very old rocks at the bottom. But it's a really amazing place, because if you look at those rocks, those are actually layered. Those are sedimentary rocks that it carved through, which means that even though it's been eroding for hundreds of millions of years, it actually took hundreds of millions of years to pile those up and to keep depositing them. So, really amazing place for geology, probably one of the best in the world. Hope you enjoyed it, class.